Hi guys, welcome back to the channel on the dinner menu tonight. I have a beautiful bacon, lettuce and tomato salad. Not a sandwich, this is a salad that's comprised of slow roasted tomatoes, beautiful fresh lettuce, a creamy blue cheese dressing, salty bacon. This is a next level BLT salad. Now before we get into this, of course, if you're new to this channel and you want delicious recipes to your doorstep in a matter of moments, make sure you hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you're the first to get notified when I post. Right, first job is to make sure that we have slow roasted tomatoes. Now normally in the BLT sandwich you have the bacon, lettuce and tomato all stacked up but I want to bring things alive a little bit in this recipe so I'm going to slow roast the tomatoes to bring out their sweetness and give them that gorgeous caramelized finish and I have a beautiful selection of tomatoes so all I'm going to do is slice them in half, give them a little bit of texture and get them into the oven. Okay, tomatoes are nicely sliced up. As you can see, really nice selection, and it's good if you do have a selection, because it just makes your salad look all that more interesting. All I gotta do now is oil these babies up, a little bit of balsamic vinegar and some salt and pepper, and then into the oven at about 200 degrees Celsius, that's 400 degrees Fahrenheit. And you're gonna roast them off for about like 35 to 40 minutes, and really the way to know that they're done is that they're kind of caramelized, reduced, and nice and bubbling. Okay, we've got tomatoes roasting in the oven and now it's time to talk about the possibly the second or third most important element of a BLT salad that is of course the lettuce leaves. Now I've got a selection, two, two nice heads of romaine lettuce here and one thing I will say is that I of course am a victim to those plastic bags of some salad leaves in a bit of a fix but if you can wash your own and store them they will keep in the fridge for about five days so this little montage method that I'm going to show you right now is a great way of taking those store-bought lettuce heads and making them last. So, cue salad spinning montage. You have a beautiful bowl of washed salad leaves ready for salads, sandwiches, whatever you fancy really. Right, we've got the T for the tomatoes, we've got the L for the lettuce, and now we need to talk about the bacon. Sorry, I'm being interrupted by a tiny, tiny toddler. Very simple, in a frying pan, cold, bring it up to temperature, crispy bacon. We're doing well, we've got the bacon, we've got the lettuce, we've got the tomato, I now have a camera lens that has fat splattered all over it, but that is fine because we're about to get down and dirty. The next key component to this next level BLT salad is a creamy blue cheese dressing. You only need a handful of ingredients, I've got blue cheese, I've got a little Worcestershire sauce, I've got some yogurt, I've got some mayo, and oh, uh, a little bit of lemon juice. We're gonna put it all in a bowl and mix it up until we have a nice smooth cream dressing. Okay, this blue cheese dressing is looking darn good and it's really important when you are making a dressing to make sure that you taste it. Yes, that has that lovely blue cheese salty kick. It's got a lovely little bit of freshness from that lemon juice. I also added a little bit of touch of black pepper in here and the Worcestershire sauce just kind of brings it alive and kind of amplifies the flavor. So we've got blue cheese dressing, we've got bacon, we've got lettuce, we've got tomatoes. Last and final thing, considering this is based on a sandwich, I thought it was imperative that we included some delicious croutons in this very simple salad. So I'm just gonna slice up a loaf into nice cubes, a little bit of olive oil, a little salt and pepper into the oven. They literally are gonna take about 10, 15 minutes, just until they're golden brown. Right, it's got a little bit darker now, the sun is coming down, dinner needs to be served. So we're gonna bring all these different elements out. I have my bacon, I have my dressing, I have my tomatoes, I have my croutons. Uh, I'm gonna bring it all out and get a nice Instagram photo before I completely lose the light. And then uh, it's time to tuck in for dinner. Beep, beep. 
Right, there you go. We've dinner served to the table. Looking good. I have a baby that's going to want to eat now, so I'm hoping to wrap this up. Um, but look, once you've assembled it like this and you have all the different components, I've drizzled with a little bit of that dressing, all you're going to do is get your salad tossing hands in and get this mixed up and served over. I think you want a little bit of everything so everyone's happy. Isn't that right, Sophie? Yes. Would you like me to start? <laughs> it's time to eat. Have a look at this, it is all served up. You've got bacon, you've got the tomatoes, you've got the croutons, all the things to get you excited. And of course, don't forget about that blue cheese dressing. Uh, I'm gonna tuck in and try a little bit of the salad just to make sure that it's all on the right track. Mm. It is all about that dressing. Mm. Then you also get that like dark sweet flavor from the roast tomatoes. I have stuff dribbling down my mouth, that's how good this is. Uh, bacon, croutons, look, you can't go wrong. This is an easy salad recipe, anyone can give this a go. You can make this for dinner in just a matter of minutes. If you want the recipe, we will leave it in the link below. Check it out over on my website, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. And what else do you need to do? Oh, leave me a comment letting me know if you're gonna try this. Um, it's a really simple salad, lots of tasty things going on. Uh, tune into the channel, we've got lots more recipes coming your way. Goodbye.